Narrated by Abu Burda's father. The Prophet peace be upon him said, three persons will get their reward twice. One is, a person who has a slave girl and he educates her properly and teaches her good manners properly, without violence, and then monuments and marries her. Such a person will get a double reward. Another is, a believer from the people of the scriptures who has been a true believer and then he believes in the Prophet peace be upon him Muhammad. Such a person will get a double reward. The third is, a slave who observes Allah's rights and obligations and is sincere to his master. Narrated by Asab bin Jaythama. The Prophet peace be upon him passed by me at a place called Alabwe or Wadan, and was asked whether it was permissible to attack the pagan warriors at night with the probability of exposing their women and children to danger. The Prophet peace be upon him replied, they, i.e. women and children, are from them, i.e. pagans, I also heard the Prophet peace be upon him saying, the institution of Hima is invalid except for Allah and his Apostle. Narrated by Asab bin Jaythama. The Prophet peace be upon him passed by me at a place called Alabwe or Wadan, and was asked whether it was permissible to attack the pagan warriors at night with the probability of exposing their women and children to danger. The Prophet peace be upon him replied, They, i.e. women and children, are from them, i.e. pagans, I also heard the Prophet peace be upon him saying, The institution of Hima is invalid except for Allah and his Apostle. Narrated by Abdullah during some of the Ghazawat of the Prophet peace be upon him a woman was found killed. Allah's messenger peace be upon him disapproved the killing of women and children. Narrated by Ibn Umar. During some of the Ghazawat of Allah's messenger peace be upon him a woman was found killed, so Allah's messenger peace be upon him forbade the killing of women and children.